Hello everyone, I'm Donita from Visiotech and today I'll be demonstrating on how you can use our products to make your life easier. Stay tuned. Hi, please take note of the following if you've purchased our smart doorbell. You need to open the back of it like this. It's got two batteries in. What you need to do is remove the batteries and you'll see that there is a sticker on the back of the batteries so in order for the doorbell to work and charge you need to remove this you can use a standing knife anything just to remove it and there we go that's the way it will work you cannot use it until you remove this tape off the batteries it's just for transport so the batteries don't go flat so your doorbell does work you just need to remove that thank you Okay, so I held in this reset button at the back for three seconds. One, two, three. System reset. She says system reset. <clears throat> the camera is now ready to begin pairing. Okay, then you go to this little one. And you see this button here? Hold it in, one, two, three, four, one, that's how they connect, and they are connected, so when you push the button, they both ring. The camera is now ready to begin pairing. Now you need to pair it on your either your Tia app or your Smart Life app. And then of course this button here is to choose different tones. So there's one, two, there's so many. Hi all, I'm just going to show you a quick way to set up your doorbell on your Smart Life app. I am thinking that two years the same so you go to add device you go to security and video you choose smart doorbell not doorbell camera smart doorbell the camera is now ready to begin and she will make sure you hear her then you say next Email. Email. your username and password then you'll take the doorbell and face it to the QR code information received. and she shouts at you I heard a prompt, you let it run, and it is set up, and you can go to edit, you can choose the room that you want it in, and you say done. Let's just give it a few seconds to come up. And there we go. As you can see the camera is a bit slow at the moment because it's on HD. So what you can do is tap on that HD and change it to SD. It also depends on how far your doorbell is going to be from your Wi-Fi. So yes. There we go, SD, and you can turn it, and the doorbell is working, and it can even look at itself. So yes, that's how you set up our Vizier doorbell. This is the one with the round button. There is one that looks like this on the box. So this will be silver, and it'll have the oval door, doorbell button, and then that's the ringer. Okay. 